Hello, I hope you're having a fantastic day. My name is Orion and today I'm going to be sharing with you the, the meaning of angel message number one. So one is all about new beginnings. It's all about standing up straight, you know, going in a new direction. One might mean it's time to have new goals, new dreams, it might be time to think of a new plan. It might be time to implement new behaviors in your routine. It might be time to look for new ways to express yourself new ways to connect with your inner self as well. One also has the meaning of independence. It's everything might be going this direction, but it's like, I gotta do my thing. Standing up for yourself is very important, but also going in one direction, not just using your energy crazy. One is going in one direction, knowing what you want, knowing what you need, and doing what it takes to go and get after it. One could also be a time of isolation and independence and not really needing other people's energies or a time of self-reflection. If you're seeing a lot of ones, it might be time for a new start, it might be time for a new place, it might be time for a new mindset, but it also might be time to, okay, I need to take my energy and I need to dial it in. And I need to really focus on what is my energy, what is my goals, what direction do I really want to go, and instead of being influenced by, you know, the environment, what's going around you, instead of being influenced by like your fears, instead of being influenced by what has affected you in the past, one is all right, is all about, all right, I'm the creator of my story and I've got a blank page and I'm going to write down whatever I want. I'm going to go in whatever direction I want. Uh, it's fearless. It's courage. It's success. Like number one is I have an idea and I'm going to keep working until I get it right. So the last thing about the spirit of the meaning of angel number one is that we are all one thing. Everything is under source. Everything is in harmony with one another. Ones are not only just to take self-reflection and look inward, but to think, how are you a part of the grand scheme of things? How are you, what are your roles in your environment? What are your roles in your community? What are your roles in how you create spirit, how you partake and how you partake in the exchange of energy from the earth and in between the universe and how you do your own personal thing to create. So I hope that is helpful for y'all. I hope that's groovy and cool. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.